CRC is quite a unique school, it's very different to other schools in that it uh, first and foremost is a senior secondary college, 800 or around 800 year 11 and 12 students, but we also specialise in senior secondary pathways, that is that we offer the Victorian Certificate of Education, the Victorian Certificate of Applied Learning, as well as a, a wide variety of vocational education and training programs that are unmatched by any other school in Australia. In 2007, uh, Trades Training Centre grants came out and were announced and we applied for a, a grant. We're already going down the track of wanting to put in vocational education and training programs. That was about access and equity for our students, to give them a real chance and to tell students that we valued every pathway, that the only pathway wasn't just about university, that there's a myriad of opportunities out there for young people and that they should be looking wider because for some young people, uh, university isn't the answer and isn't the only option. For others it is. And so we decided very early on that we had to offer all pathways and as many opportunities to our young people as possible. And so the Trades Training Centre grants were an opportunity for us to provide that access and equity to pathways that many of our students hadn't explored previously. We offer 38 different VET courses on site, uh, ranging from hospitality, beauty, baking, picture framing, uh, sign writing. There's a whole range of unique opportunities that many families don't think about prior to enrolling in a school. And when they do come to this school at Catholic Regional College Sydenham, they're amazed at, at what's on offer and what students can access through the VCE and the VCAL. It really opens doors to students and opens their minds to possibilities that perhaps they haven't thought of in the past. To have a, uh, a vocational education and training uh, area that's really legitimate and is recognised by industry, we had to think about what it was that industry was looking for. And industry values the experience that their industry has. And so we wanted to capture that within the Trades Training Centre here at Catholic Regional College Sydenham. In order to do that, we had to employ people from industry who were passionate, really passionate about their industry, but also people that could work with young people and uh, engage them in, in the real work that they were going to be undertaking. And that's been really successful in each uh, of the industry areas. We've had some brilliant staff and, and, and they're very passionate about what they do and work phenomenally well with the young people. Now, to have 400 students enrolled in vocational education and training meant 400 work placements we actually could not have students out of the college, 400 of them, and, and actually be able to go and assess them in the workplace. So the answer was to open our own businesses, to establish businesses that students would work in, that would be run by industry professionals here on site at the college. So it's really a, a shopping centre on a school site, if you will. It's about young people learning the business of their industry while still at school and engaging with real clients while working with real professionals. Students at Catholic Regional College Sydenham don't pay anything. It's free, it's part of the normal coursework that they can access. So we actually invest the money back into providing services for young people so that they have every opportunity. It comes back to that access and equity. It's about young people being afforded every single opportunity they can. And if the school makes money out of the businesses, then it should go back into the most important thing in a school, and that's the students. Each of the Trade Training Centre courses has its own industry partners, and they've been on board from the, the very beginning. I can give you one example, and that would be in signage. Roland, who make all of the sign writing equipment, came on board right from the outset and have provided us with uh, all of the best equipment. I guess the best success, though, is the end result and that's that our students are getting apprenticeships, they are getting work and they are going on to further study. Those students who may have been at risk of being disengaged are now more engaged. It's giving them pathways that they never thought possible and that's what education is about.